What's up everybody, it's Morphin Time. It's Prototype here, bringing you some Power Rangers Legacy Wars gameplay today. And I, I was looking at this this morning, and they were all here, and then the update happened. I didn't even realize we were getting a new character this weekend. So, sorry I missed the replays. They were there when I got up, and I should have recorded then, I guess. But if you guys want to throw in some replays, I'll be sure to do it on Sunday instead. But today we are going to now look at new... Ranger that's been brought in. Alyssa and Rayleigh from Wild Force. Uh, I've used her a bunch today just to see what she was like. And honestly, like her not as big damage is good, but I do think she can be completely broken. <laughs> like I, She's like a really in-between kind of character because you can get stuck with this Tiger Claw and the White Tiger Baton a lot. And it's garbage, so I do recommend running a strike assist with her to avoid that whole situation. And the Tiger Claw has, like, no range and does little damage. I don't even know why it's there. It's not very good to use. So, you, I mean, waste it when you can or throw it at the end of a combo when you can, but it's, I mean, it's a garbage attack. You're, you know, you're going to cancel your wild launch strike here and stuff. Tiger Thrust has a stun to it. White Tiger Baton has a stun to it. You can pretty much just cycle between two of those and win a match. It's actually pretty... Dumb. Like, it's, <laughs> she has too much stuns. It's another character that just got loaded up with stuns to keep... I have no idea. I I hate that characters now are just getting constant stuns. It's, it's disgusting. Like, make us actually have to play the game. Anyway, so this is my very first match with her. And I lose pretty much, I just panic at the end. Fell for that strike cancel when I really shouldn't have. I did not know how uh, big of a range or strike was going to have. Get a nice little catch here, and then I realized I flipped to me, which was not good. And right here, now I'm stuck with breaker breaker defense. And I really shouldn't be. <laughs> Pretty much just did that to get rid of it. They're wasting their zero shield, which I actually recommend you do. She has a nice mid-range attack here. I mean, everything she does is mid. It's kind of quick. It's not the fastest in the world. Unfortunately, I just wasted my shield. Right there, I couldn't get the strike to come out for some stupid reason. Because this game literally just doesn't like to do anything. I accidentally pressed that right there. But I also figured they were going to uh, defense. Because they seen the Zenaku coming. So I tried for the breaker there. I ended up losing. And if I had to get a strike there, I probably could have won. But, you know, this game and me, just input difference, never works out in my favor. Alright, then we get our first victory here. And she can be, she really can be overpowered when you get the right rotations with her. It's just, it's just absurd. I, I hate that her, every attack she has has stuns. And, like, constant stun. Stun. Dashboard, it's done. And right there, if I had anything else, like a, a 2 or 3 ability, I could have kept that combo going. I thought the Zenaku would have came out quicker, that's why I hit that instead of the strike. And boom, stun. Back and forward, hit, stun. <laughs> like, oh, it's stupid. I, I really hate that so much. Right there, I couldn't get the defense to activate. And, like, you just, it, almost no time to recover from that. I'm like, okay, it's done. <laughs> Hit you back. Cancel. It's done. <laughs> like, it is stupid. I, do, <laughs> I think they could have did it a lot more. And I think they really should be making characters do more, like, a, a skill-based thing. Most characters now, they really don't require much skill at all. You just gotta get a nice little cancel in there and spam their third uh, 
special attack or whatever it is called. Um, okay, I'll show this one. I like to show this one is because his clan thing is called We Never Lose, and I beat him, so <laughs> it's just funny. Stun, dash up, bang, bang, stun, dash up, wait around. She actually does get zero shields pretty often. You might not even need to run a defense assist with her. She's kind of like uh, Green Ranger Tommy. Tons of shields. Hit the stun there. What am I going to do? Yep, four ability stuns again. And they're her big damage attacks, so once you get one, you instantly get the second one. Like, if you had her skill tree up, the, the match would be over so fast. Just trying to learn the distance on that, and that attack really is not good. Tiger Claw is useless for the most part. And we just stun our way to victory. Just, I mean, it's just ridiculous. Um, what am I looking at here? You never lose. I think this is the person. It shows it like the opposite way. Like, I'm pretty sure I got a bad rotation of abilities here, and they just dominate me. Stuns, fast forward, stuns. Not a big lot of damage there, unfortunately. Couldn't dash away. Somehow hers lands. Mine never do at any distance, I swear. Those tiger claws. Went for it to get rid of it. Stun, go for the tiger claw. Finally hits for once. I don't know why I tried to dash there instead of just going for the strike. This isn't even the matchup I was thinking of. <laughs> and I couldn't get the cancel there. I really was not trying to go full out. And the claw doesn't land, obviously. I just jump in front of her and die. But still trying to gauge the distance of that. And it's just no good. Just a no good attack. Everything else she has is fantastic. Um, those matches are whatever. Okay, now this is when I, I'm switching to the strike as an assist instead. I even put it down to a three, so I, you'd have some kind of follow up after uh, using our middle slot so much. Okay, just dash, stun. So I decided to go for it just to do something different instead of constantly spamming my middle slot here. I thought that was going to come out quicker, and really it did in the match, but in the replay you can see the difference in the connection there. You gotta dash really far. Like, look, she did full screen. So she also has a complete full screen attack. <laughs> like, it is so dumb. I don't like that they make characters this way. Once again, just stunning my way to victory. Did get a lot of not so great losses while doing this.
but connection is a very big thing in this game. Pretty sure this person comes close. Because, I mean, Tori's good. She's always good against everybody. She's very well balanced to fight everyone. I decided to just go full out. See where we can go with it. I had to waste a shield. I found I had to waste shields a lot with her. So, literally, you probably don't need to run a defensive assist. Like, <laughs> she even shielded, and it's just, <laughs> I was still going with my breaker from the other side. <laughs> like, oh man, you, you just can't help but say just how ridiculous it truly is that you can do that. So like really my, my kind of initial thoughts are with the right person, she's completely broken. Just, well, I shouldn't say completely broken. I mean, you if you have a good reaction time, she's very beatable. And in, also realistically, if you're running a lot of uh, low ability people that do damage, like I think Ranger Slayer will be, would dominate this matchup just because you can stay on top of her. And not let her get uh, her middle slot off all the time. The one good thing about both of her attacks are that they're four abilities. So once you do two, you kind of got to recharge to get the next one. But uh, I do think it's ridiculous that she has these stuns like this. It's not much different than uh, Cyber Villain outside. Cyber Villain also gets that like ability steal thing, which is just nuts. It's like, yeah, okay, just wait in a sec. And apparently Tommy is quicker. And just smack her again. So like I said, kind of broken, kind of not. She's a little in between. You get the right rotation of abilities, you're going to dominate. I'm actually going to do a match here now. going to run another. She gets a lot of shields. She does get a lot of shields. You don't want her to go fully away. Hmm, interesting. Who would I normally run is the, is what I try to look at here. Yeah, let's go ahead. Why not? Let's have another assist. Do a match. Ooh. Apparently we need an update. We're gonna go with this team and try without any defensive assists. I honestly think it will work out. You mm. do get that zero shield a lot. And I mean, you're running with Connor or uh, Dino Thunder Black Tommy. Any kind of quick stun attack. You should just be constantly stunning for the win. Ah, uh, good. I forgot you can cancel hers. You're so dumb. Like, what is this? Every character has to have a stun. And like, come on. Sit in full recharge here, right? We're going to back away. Oh no! Oh crap. And it's over. Accidentally hit that middle slot twice. The one reason why I don't like uh, 
That person we fought there is her juggling ability. She's not broken. She has that free pop-up, mm. which is stupid. But, uh... She does everything juggles. No character... I really don't think any character that's been coming out in the last few months is a true skill character. I think you just mash buttons and you can win most of the time. Not against everybody. I was, you see me there just straight up lose. How's he not cancel? I, it always mystifies me that people just don't cancel. Like, How do you have a defense ready to go there? And of course, Connor's too quick. Yeah, I can't get a strike off. Sure, bye. I couldn't dash away from that? Wow, okay. Complete nonsense that I'm losing to, seriously. <laughs> Complete and other nonsense. I'll do one more. No need to show a pile of losses there. Mm. So far, going back on my words, oh, jeez. Probably do need to run a defensive assist, I'm now learning. This match is over before he began. I'm not even. Yep, sure. Yep. No doubt. Look at all these stuns. What a what a very skillful character do you have to use? I mean, geez. Oh, look at the dash with the stuns and then the ability steal that's coming up. Oh wow. I can't believe how good you are, sir. How did you ever learn how to use cyber villains so well? <laughs> it's just stupid, man. He's... Oh, my God. Please, make a character worth... Worth, like some ability or knowledge of how to play this game we'll do one more why not why not show a bunch of losses everybody uses overpowered people on this met on the challenge anyway see how she stacks up connor i mean the connor one we should have probably won we had a bit of a delay on most of that Psycho Pink is OP as hell. She really is. How does my shield not come out there? And my shield don't come out again. And it don't work again. No doubt. Oh yeah, and then you managed to strike cancel out of that, eh? I'm sure. I seriously should just quit playing this game. How did you get the time to shield that there? Input delay, man, and all that nonsense. This game is just not that fun anymore. Anyway, that will bring an end to today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button as well help me out. And if you're watching more videos on this channel and you're enjoying them, please hit subscribe as that will also really help me out. Alright, see you next time.